Uh, one of the things I was thinking when you said that, you know, in terms of the images that you have, mm -hmm. if there's going to be um, a group of individuals in the room just to get them started right. in a PowerPoint, you know, if you mm -hmm. have a PowerPoint of certain images mm -hmm. and all of them will respond, mm -hmm. uh, and, you know, they'll probably respond differently, but mm -hmm. each one of them will have a memory. Mm -hmm. So sure. you're able to mm -hmm. capture a mm -hmm. lot of information. Mm -hmm. that we can have somebody with a remote mic, mm -hmm. uh, you know, go around. And it's also, it will be recorded. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, that'll be fun. Mm -hmm. It could be. The challenge would be getting them to stop talking. Mm -hmm. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you said the bar will be open too? Yeah. <laughs> right. Uh -oh. Oh, my God. Yeah. That reminds me, though, that uh, when I used to visit uh, Mary Alexander, cousin Mary, at the house, she did have some old family photos. I wonder what's happened to those. I mean, she had like, you know, the grandparents and stuff. I mean, she had really great photos. I wonder what happened to them. Steve, are you still there? Steve? Yes, I'm here. Uh, did you hear Lewis's question about the photos that cousin Mary had? A little hard for me to hear, but I heard he was asking about some photos at the Coltrane house. Yeah, I wonder where those photos are now. I have and some. The, there were some you paintings some? there, too. Yeah. There were some oil paintings that right. John did when he was in high school. Yeah, mm -hmm. we, right. we have some, mm -hmm. and Robbie came down and picked up some, right? Oh, Robbie so, has some? Yeah, Robbie okay. has some, and we have some because Carter was, you know. He picked them up or he dropped them off? No, he took them. Took them back. Them. Yeah, okay. because we had a lot of a lot of furniture and record collections, and uh, she gave it to us to keep. And we kept some until the family came, because actually belonged to the family. Right. Okay. So Robbie and his wife at the time came down, and she took some, but we kept some at the house too. The photo albums we have, oh, all the okay. backyard cap uh, concerts That's we have. Right. Those. So uh, that training. That's all here. Yeah. So okay, between you and Robbie, do you think that's pretty much everything? Yeah, we can talk about it. Nothing still, got lost somewhere yeah, or anything. Yeah, because it still belongs to the family, but uh -huh. we have some of them. All right, that's you know, And there's an interesting story about that watercolor that Steve was talking about, that the two paintings that, that John did, uh, that was influenced by a rumor who came into the house who was a visual artist, <laughs> and John happened to see him painting, and he started the paintings. We did two watercolors. Right. And we are they? Well, I think we have one. I got a check, mm. and I know Robbie has one. Oh, okay. So we also have a display in the uh, cafe downstairs that we did uh, uh, as part of the Phil Aesthetic project that I did at the African American Museum. It's you know it's well sized. It's about like that, and uh, it kind of traces the history of Local 274 and the Club Club. And so there's some pretty good photographs of you know the original founders of the union and uh, uh, some of the famous musicians who were part of the uh, club club as well as contemporary, you know, the education program and the young people that have been involved with that that have gone on to great careers in uh, the music, so. Ooh. And you know, I mean, Susan, maybe we can find some time to uh, have you guys come in and record, you know, 15 minutes just to put the call out on air. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. yes. Yeah. that's a good idea. All right.